Bills hold out against this mighty pressure from England. Atoje, sinker, rocks and rolls. Does he get it down? Matthew Raynell takes a very close look indeed. Not that long ago, just four years for Wales, but what a mess they've got themselves into with these contracts, player representation on boards. And cup rules, but penalty at the scrum, England winning six scrum penalty. Yeah, certainly, and this is an area where Wales would have wanted to try and get some dominance. One thing for me with England makes them so strong is their mobility of their front row. Alice Genge, Carl Sinkler, Jamie George, their ability to ball. Ireland earlier on was, was brilliant with end to end stuff, both sides providing splashes of radiant rugby colour. Well, that discussion with uh, Michel Reynal seems to have paid off for Thomas Francis. But a swing low reverberating around the Principality Stadium. The Welsh will, well, they'll draw that out, out surely. Well, they can't at the moment. They're doing their best as a whale to this scrum. Reynolds going to go, I think, for the reset. Rounds one and two. Bang! Against Ireland and Scotland. 27 3. They were down here to the Irish. Conceded two tries in eight minutes against the team now on course, potentially for a grand slam. Grudge! Bang! Free kick for England this time. And again, oh, that's, it's the second. It's the second. it's the second time, so there's an upgrade yeah, from an England yes. point of view. Downgrade from a Welsh one, they get the penalty. Second tally engage. And another one the roof. There was a three metre gap on the roof for the whole Bang. game, and the rain poured through it for the entire match. <laughs> A very bizarre and surreal sight. Off goes Thomas. There he is. Swing low is still the dominant sound in this stadium. Where have the voices of the Welsh Valleys gone? 